Hey there, friends. Welcome back to the channel where we explore the best tools and strategies to grow your online business. I'm Rebecca Austin, Kajabi mentor and conversion coach. And today I'm sharing a tool that has completely blown my mind. And judging by the emails I'm getting from clients, it's blowing theirs too. We are talking about Sintra AI, an all-in-one AI-powered assistant that can transform the way you work, whether you're creating content, managing your business, or just trying to keep your life organized. Regardless of what you currently think about AI tools in general, there's no question that leveraging AI in your business is one of the fastest and easiest ways to get ahead of the competition. And Sintra AI is, in my opinion, a game changer for coaches and course creators specifically. Why? Because building a successful online business requires you to wear so many proverbial hats, including things like business manager, website designer, graphic designer, social media manager, copywriter, marketing manager, customer service, data analyst, just to name a few. You either need to pull your hair out trying to juggle all these roles, or you could try hiring assistants or team members who could do them for you. But what if you don't have it in your budget to hire a big team? Well, that's just one of the many reasons why I'm introducing you to the power of Sintra AI. This relatively new AI tool is specifically designed to take on the role of 12 employees. In my business, I've already found Sintra to be a huge time saver, giving me back at least two hours of time a week and sometimes more. Hey, just in case you were thinking about jumping over to the Sintra website right now and checking it out for yourself, be sure to use the link in the description below this video, which is our special affiliate link. It helps us out immensely when you do, big thanks in advance. Okay back to the main video. Let me give you an example. One of my clients recently shared how Sintra AI helped her overcome a major roadblock while working on a slideshow script. Not only did Sintra combine her lesson content with her slides effortlessly, but it also guided her step-by-step -step on the best ways to organize everything. And the best part, it felt like working with a real assistant who just gets it. So you can really see the power of Sintra. Let me log in and give you a walkthrough of some of Sintra's most powerful features while showing you why this tool is a game changer, especially for online entrepreneurs like us. And don't forget, if you're ready to try it out for yourself, Check out the description below for my affiliate link. It's the easiest way to experience this magic firsthand. Okay, are you ready to see it for yourself? I'm so excited to share this with you. Okay, so the designers of Sintra AI have made it specifically so there's a more personal approach. A lot of the AI tools that are out there feels very separated. It's very much like we're just entering data and getting data kicked back to us. And even though Sintra does that as well, it also has a more personal approach to it. So what we can do, as you notice on the main dashboard, is you have access to 12 employees uh, as far as their role. We have Buddy, who is our business development manager. We have Cassie our, for customer support. We have Comet, who handles e-commerce. Dexter is the data analyst. Emmy is for email marketing. Gigi handles personal development. I'll go over each one of these and share some of the things that they'll do for you. It's so cool. Millie does sales management. Penn is your copywriter. Scouty for recruiting. Xiaomi for SEO specialist. Soshi for social media manager. And Vizzy is your virtual assistant. And each one has special programming to help you in each one of these roles. Now, what's really cool about this, when I first logged into Sintra, it asks me a series of questions so that the system itself can get to know not only you, but also your business and your audience. So the more data that you give it, the more that it learns. And the more you use it, the more that it learns and can better serve you. Just like when you hire a new employee, they may know their role, but they don't know your company and so it takes some time for their, them to understand the specifics of what your expectations are, your voice, your tone, what are your primary needs as far as your audience, and all of those kind of things. So what we can do then is we can program it as we go. And 
even then, sometimes we don't even know what to tell them. The system actually prompts you, which basically adds that data to what they call the overall brain of your company. As a side note too, when you subscribe to Sintra AI, at least at the time of recording this video, you can actually have up to five companies or brains, so to speak, that you can use inside the this one subscription. So if you're like me and you have multiple businesses that are running all at the same time, you can actually add them as separate entities, as separate brains. And so the system can differentiate between each company. You don't have to buy separate subscriptions. You just buy one and you can just add multiple brains. So for example, I have two currently set up our main company, Strive for Savvy, where we help entrepreneurs to grow their online business. And then I have my original online company that got me into this space in the first place, which is Healthy Homestead Living. And then we're also going to be adding our separate for our, uh, our retreats and our masterminds will be a separate one. So if you have multiple businesses, you can definitely include them here. Now, what's really cool then is inside each one of these, they have just similar to a chat GPT. So for example, I can go into Soshi. She is our social media manager. She's one that I have used quite a bit already, simply because social media management can be so time consuming. I had a conversation back and forth with her. It's very, you can do it very conversational, similar to an actual person or an employee. And if we go into the settings tab here, you can actually change your settings. So if I want my conversation with Soshi to be like super chill, or if I wanted to be strictly professional, you can change your settings of how that conversation, how that person talks back with you. Personally, I kind of like the middle of the range. I like a business casual where we can have a conversation like I would with one of my employees. You can also then change your message length. So we maybe want to have this to be a little bit longer. We may want her to be more of an expert. Um, we can set up here whether or not they search Google for their responses and they can copy your writing style. So this is really helpful when you're talking to the copywriter and you're entering some of your typical copy for her as a her, I use uh, loosely since it's just it's pen and they it's portrayed as a female. But essentially, when you are programming the system to you, you can set it up to to copy your writing style. So this is really a neat thing. But what they have in here is what are called power-ups. So under each one of the employees, they have specific extra things they can do for you. So for Soshi, for example, we can create engaging LinkedIn posts. We can um, do create a calendar. So you can set up your social media calendar, generate ideas for your different social channels and um, reels, find viral trends. I mean, these are some really amazing tools that are available inside here that she can do for you in addition to the regular back and forth chat type of things that you would normally find in something like ChatGPT. Okay, so if we go back in here, um, we could look at Buddy, for example. I'm not gonna do all of them for the sake of time, but you can see then that Buddy, as a business manager, he can create your marketing strategy. He can create a newsletter strategy. He can set up a target audience, audience analyzer, a business idea generator, brand generator, competition analyzer, product launch, investor updates, email writer, meeting notes. So there's so many different things that are automatically programmed in here from a business perspective. As an online entrepreneur, as a solopreneur, I do have team members. So in my case, I already have a graphic designer. I have a social media manager. I have a copywriter. But so much more powerful when we can combine the tools. And if you're a solopreneur, like literally a solopreneur, you don't even have a single employee. Having the ability to tap into some of these tools is incredibly powerful. So one of the things you can do is you can actually go into this brain icon that's off to the side. And you can integrate this directly with your social channels, your Google, and coming very soon will be things like Slack and Asana, where then it will automatically send tasks to Asana and Slack so that there's more cohesiveness on the communication and the tasks and the project management. This is so exciting. 
Your virtual assistant, Vizzy, then has access to your Google Calendar so she can give you a summary of what is going on. She can, you can dictate an email. I've done this. It's really cool. Dictate an email. Tell her what you want the email to be. She'll send that for you. Some really amazing things that are going on here. So the other thing is, um, as we talked about power ups, we can look at this from this tab off to the side, specifically under each employee on some of the things that each employee can do for you. And so far, the experience that I've had with it has been mind boggling. It's absolutely mind boggling. It comes up with ideas. So you can see here, there's 12 new ideas that the employee will then present to you on each one of these. So Gigi is a personal assistant. She has an idea. Hey, I can create five minute morning success ritual guide for you. And then if you want her to go ahead and give that to you, you simply click the heart or you can close out of it. So I'm like, yeah, I, I kind of like to know what that is. Penn, as your digital uh, copywriter, she says, well, I'll write from uh, DJ to digital success story series. Well, that doesn't sound very interesting to me right now, so I'll say no. So she will create a tech-free Tuesday productivity tip. I'm like, oh, that sounds interesting for social media management. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll say, yeah, go ahead and give that to me. Dexter will analyze ideal coaching call times. You know, he's looking at my data because I'm giving him all that information then I can go all through all these ideas. And when you're not, when you're ready, you can go back every day. There will be some new questions to prompt you to help the system in learning your business and understanding your business. So it takes maybe 10 minutes every morning to go through the questions, help train my staff and give it more details. So tons of opportunities in here. You can see where the power is literally mind boggling on, on the different things that are available inside this new Sintra series. So you might be wondering, okay, that sounds really cool, but do I really need this tool? And I would say if you're juggling multiple roles in your business or simply want to save time and energy, the answer is yes, you should at least check it out. As, because Sintra helps you to work smarter by automating time-consuming tasks so you can focus on what you do best. And there's certain tasks in your business that only you can do. And there's certain tasks that AI can save time. Then we turn that around and still use that as a time-saving tool, but then put your own voice and your own personality behind what you're putting out there. It can also help you create new content faster because it's generating high-quality content in minutes. It can also help in growing your business by helping you stay consistent, organized, and ahead of the curve. And honestly, it's just fun to use. You'll find yourself saying, why didn't I try this sooner? I mean, I know that from my perspective, I'm like, where was this before, and it's so exciting to see where technology is taking us from a, a tools perspective to make it so much easier for us to focus on the things that we are good at, where we shine in our business, and not spend so much time on the tedious type tasks that just suck our time. So I'm curious, what do you think? Is Sintra AI the assistant you didn't know you needed? I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments below. And if you're ready to experience for yourself, as I mentioned, click the affiliate link in the description to get started. Trust me, this is one tool you'll enjoy experimenting with, especially since the more you use it, the more it gets to know you, your business, and your audience. So I'm curious, if you're currently using AI in your business in any way, shape, or form, give me a thumbs up on this video so I can kind of get a litmus test of how many people are actually using AI. And while you're there, I invite you to subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications so you don't miss more reviews like this one and more tips to grow your online business. Until next time, remember the key to success is working smarter, not harder. Keep learning, keep growing. Bye for now.